everybody, and welcome back to the Wattpad Book Club. My name is Phoenix, and once again, I am joined with my lovely friend, Kenzie. Hello! Welcome back to the show. <laughs> Glad to be back. <laughs> yep, and um, today, we're not going to be reading any fanfiction. We're going to be writing our own fanfiction. Woohoo! Let's go! Yep, another continuation of Chris X Chef. Production in Yeehaw. progress. Yeehaw! I <laughs> cannot <laughs> wait to write more. I have a lot of ideas. Yes. So, um, I, for some reason, I got hit with the, the creative stick randomly, so I just started okay. writing. So, yeah. I'm hoping what I wrote was good, because sometimes when yeah. I- Because sometimes I'll look back on stuff and be like, what have I done? <laughs> yeah. I'm seeing what you got so far, it's pretty good. Yeah, let me go ahead and pull that up. I, yeah, mm -hmm. so I guess we should... Let me see. Yeah, this is the last thing that we wrote on a video was uh, Chris leaving the office. <laughs> and then thinking yeah. about Jeff. And then there's a little bit of a time skips. And then everything else is yep. what I've written off screen. So I guess we should go ahead and read through this. And then see if we can fix anything or add something and then uh, continue writing. <laughs> Okie dokie. Alright. The weekend rolled by fast and soon enough, Monday morning was dawning. Putting on a nice blue sweater and some jeans, I headed out the door into the office. Not only would I be in the costume department trying to find the main outfit for me to wear during the show, but I would also be seeing Chef again. <laughs> <laughs> Finding a spot in the crowded parking lot, I hurried inside, walking past interns and writers hard at work. I, I reached room 268, where the costume department was being held for the time being, and opened the door. Some of the directors were in there, along with some interns making concept drawings of a few outfits for me, and a few others finishing sewing one of them. Good morning, Chris, shouted one of the directors in my direction. Hey, good morning, I said, closing the door behind me. You came just in time. We got a few outfits for you to try on. Hopefully if, hopefully if one of them is the one, we can start filming the promotional tapes so we can start going through the audition process. That the costume director said excitedly. Great, I can't wait to start. We'll start with dress rehearsal once Chef gets here. That way the two outfits go together well. Until he gets here, we got donuts and coffee in the break room if you want some. Sure, thanks. The costume director went back over to one of the interns to check over some of the outfits, while I put my stuff on the table and walked out of the room. I started heading down the hallway towards the break room, walking past a couple- walking- oh shit. <laughs> walking past a couple <laughs> of busy rooms. I opened the door to the break room to find it empty. Donut case is half empty, and they- and a few box coffees left on the counter. I couldn't remember if these- they're called box coffees, right? Like, um... Yeah, I think so. Yeah, because I remember going to, like, um, this makes me sound old, but in elementary school, when they had, like, the little Santa thing going on, they had little, yeah. those, the, like, the box coffees. That way, it's, like, self-service yeah. almost. Mm -hmm. I was thinking of yeah. those when I was writing. Yeah. <laughs> Left on the counter. Grabbing a nearby napkin, I grabbed a jelly-filled donut and started making coffee the way I like it. Hearing the door open behind me, I turned to see Chef walking in. Outfitter in a beige shirt and black pants. Oh. Oh, um, um, uh, hi, Chris. Uh, was it? Yeah, that's me. Nice to see you again. I said, turning back to my coffee. Yeah, same. It's nice to see one familiar place in here, said Jeff, grabbing a chocolate-covered donut. After adding in the milk and sugar to my liking, I turned back to Chef while drinking some of it. It looks like we'll be in the costume department today, I said. Oh, really? That sounds like fun, he said, taking a bite of his donut. Alright, and that's how far I got before I actually okay. had to get back to work. <laughs> okay. I really like how this was looking so far. Yeah, I was like, they need to have some kind of natural thing before they get thrown into, like, um, <laughs> doing shit. Because maybe we can have chapter three be them doing the dress rehearsal thing. Ooh, yeah. Like, make That'd them end on a good note in the break room and then next chapter. Yeah. Is mm -hmm. them trying on outfits. <laughs> Mm -hmm. how, how the fuck should we have this conversation go? Mm. Hmm. 
Hold on, let me grab my little notebook thing. I haven't written anything in okay. here. Just like sometimes you need to like jot yeah. like jot down just some random shit to know what you're doing. Yeah. <laughs> okay. All right. It's funny, so... cause, like every time I try to come up with ideas to when like when it comes to, like writing fan fictions of conversations, it's so hard. I can't think of what I should make uh characters say and stuff. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, like, I mean, like, for the, like we haven't written in this in a while, because I think the last Death X uh, Chris thing that we've written was, like, months ago, and randomly, mm -hmm. I had the inspiration to write all this. Like, it popped in my brain. I'm like, I gotta get this down uh, before I forget. Yeah. <laughs> so I'm trying to figure out what, like, because I had to stop, at, like, at a certain point, you know? Because I was at yeah. work while writing this, and I actually had to go to do my job. Yeah. So, like, the thoughts that I had of this going have left, so now I gotta re-remember what this is. Okay, so, yeah. Chris enters break room, eats a donut, and makes coffee. Death also enters, and they're having a nice conversation that they're gonna be in the costume department today. And Jeff is real excited about that. What yeah. the fuck should Chris say in response, though? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Man, why are we so dumb at this? Yeah. <laughs> maybe just like maybe just agreeing with him. Yeah. I mean like yeah. Oh yeah. Oh shit! Hold on, my mouse is being. Okay. If I can get anything for Christmas, I want a mouse. <laughs> One that yeah. knows how to use the little like the the cursor thing for scrolling. Yeah. Absolute <laughs> ass. Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, oh really? That sounds like fun. He said to him by a persona. Yeah. Um. <laughs> uh, they're. They're just waiting on us to. To start. Uh, ice. Oh shit. <laughs> okay. Ice. I said. <laughs> Uh, chugging the rest of my coffee? Yeah. Imagine if he responded saying, yeah, just, yeah. Yeah. Like, like, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, like, oh shit, what is the <laughs> it, it feels horrible, but when I don't want to talk to people anymore, I just go like, yeah. Oh, it's crazy. <laughs> like that kind of thing. <laughs> yeah, same. <laughs> just make sure Chris just be like, wow, I am not interested in what you're talking about. <laughs> <Right>. <laughs> oh shit, what should Chef say back? No. <laughs> I'm like trying to like picture this in my head, like a like an actual total <laughs> drama behind the scenes episode. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> At least, like, my, my main- the, the main goal, at least for the end of part two, like, chapter two, is that, like, they, they start to bond and be friends. And they aren't gonna yeah. be a couple until, like, the end of it, because we want them to be solid friends, and then realize that they have feelings for one another, you know? Yeah. We don't want to, yeah, like, I jump agree. the gun. <laughs> yes, I completely agree. Yeah, they're just waiting on us to start, I said, chugging the rest of my coffee. Oh, well, we better get going then. <laughs> We better get yeah. going then. Yeah. I am saying yeah a lot. <laughs> <laughs> Are you bored with this and want to leave? <laughs> You're like, wow, that that's interesting. <laughs> I'm <Yeah>. oh, blah. <laughs> uh, eating the rest of his donuts. Uh, I guess this should just be a paragraph now. Yeah. <laughs> so I just... Yeah, we're doing this. Right, okay. Let's do this. Okay. Sorry, I, like, fixed some of the formatting, so... <laughs> and whatnot. I'm trying to make sure it's consistent and not breaking. <laughs> Alright. Um, cleaning up... Maybe, like, cleaning up the rest of our mess. We headed back to... We headed over to room 268 together and whatnot. And then, like, Chris gives some of his thoughts about Chef and whatnot. Yeah. This is their this is their second time 
interacting. Yeah. Uh-huh. Dude, we're so smart. <laughs> yes, absolutely. Oh, and by the way, mm-hmm. grammar error. Well, we better get in going. Shit, oh. Okay. Yeah. There you go. <laughs> maybe maybe Chef isn't like like very good at English. Just like me. <laughs> Same here. Who is texting me? Leave me alone. Oh shit, I probably should <laughs> I'll answer that later. <laughs> <laughs> oh god oh shit. Can Kenzie, do you do you play Minecraft at all? No. Okay. I, I need to talk about this, because if I talk about it on stream, he's gonna find out. He doesn't watch any of the Wattpad stuff, so I'll, I'm in the clear. <laughs> unless someone self support me. Yeah. But, like, um, I'm in this Minecraft server, and, like, a bunch of buddies, but it's, ma- it's mainly, like, Heisens and whatnot. And, like, I, yeah. miss, I messed up the whole base. I, I will be completely oh, no. <laughs> like, I was, oh, no. I was taking some iron. Because uh-huh. they have, like, an automatic uh, iron farm. That like automatically gets like a crap ton of iron. Uh-huh. So like um, I was taking some and I didn't realize there was a creeper that came behind me and it <laughs> and it just sort of like like exploded. Like if it was just the land, it would have been fine. I could just patch it up with dirt, but it also destroyed one of the chests. So oh, oh no! <laughs> so I was like panicking while running away from other monsters. Like oh no, he's gonna kill me. Oh no! I fix it though. No. He will never find it. it. Good. That's a relief. Okay, we, on that side note, we headed down the hallway. <laughs> Wait, hold on one second. All right, uh, all right. Anyway, we headed down the hallway uh, <laughs> to room. Oh, I should room be capitalized? Because if you're talking about like room, this number should it be? Should it be capitalized or no? I don't think it has to. Okay, I'm trying to like think back to like high school yeah. when they tell you where your classes are. Uh huh. Capitalize it. Yeah, I feel, yeah, we should probably just capitalize it. Like, okay. room two sixty eight. I probably should capitalize it back here. The <laughs> perfect. Okay. Yeah, because if it's like the like, what are they called? <laughs> Panels? Like a. No, not a panel. I think it's called a panel where they have it on the side of the door that tells you what the room's for and whatnot. I think yeah. they're always capitalized, so I guess it makes mm-hmm. sense for us to capitalize it in the story. Okay. Cleaning up the rest yeah. of the mess behind the hallway. Okay. Together. M- maybe holding hand. <laughs> hand in hand. <laughs> nah, that's way too soon. <laughs> Yeah. We're not like these other fanfiction writers where we jump the gun immediately. <laughs> right. <laughs> yeah, let's not do that. Yeah. <laughs> uh, what Save should... that for a later chapter. Yeah, what should some of, um, what should Chris's impression be of Chef at this moment? Hmm. I think he's, like, he thinks of him as very optimistic, like a younger version of himself of, like, how, like, enthusiastic and, like, happy he is. Yeah. And whatnot, so... Uh, looking up... Yeah, Chris is shorter than Chef, right? Yeah. Okay, yeah. <laughs> I didn't want to be, like, looking down on him. <laughs> mm-hmm. He seemed... He seems very excited to be going to costume rehearsal. How the fuck did you spell rehearsal? I just spelt it in here not too long ago. Okay, I did it. I'm a master at spelling. <laughs> uh, what else should be said? Oh, God. <laughs> I don't know why I'm under so much pressure to do this right. Maybe it's because we're recording. Yeah. Maybe when you're like trying to force ideas out, it like doesn't really work. 
Yeah. Looking at the chef, he seemed very, very excited to be going to what should, I should probably should be to the costume rehearsal. Yeah. And oh, look, look up at yeah, you. Yeah, look up at <laughs> Don't, don't worry, I got you. This is some broken ass English I'm writing down. <laughs> I was so preoccupied about spelling rehearsal right that I didn't even spell looking up, like the right grammar. <laughs> <laughs> That's all right. I make I make that mistake plenty of times in trying to write my fan fictions as well, so I get it. <laughs> yeah, you would think Google would have been like, this is not grammar, like gr yeah. grammatically correct. <laughs> Right. <laughs> they let me know when I when I mess up spelling a word, but not grammar. Yeah. <laughs> right. <laughs> uh, okay. Looking up at their mess, they we headed down the hall to room two sixty eight together. Looking up a chef, he seemed very excited to be going to costume rehearsal. Costume rehearsal. Yeah. Maybe like like. While me, on the other hand, was kind of like, whatever about it. Yeah. Oh my idea. All right, like he's like he doesn't like Chris doesn't give a shit about the dress rehearsal. He's like fifty fifty. He just like wants to get it done and whatnot. But Chef is excited. So while they're doing the dress rehearsal, like Chris starts getting like more into it as when he sees Chef having a good time doing it. Yeah. I am. A, I am a genius. I'm writing this down before I forget. <laughs> Let's go! Alright. That's perfect. Uh, me, on the other hand... Didn't really care how it went. <laughs> it was just costumes. <laughs> how exciting could that be? Entering the room. Do costume director be capitalized? Um. Uh. I don't. I don't think so. Costume director. Also, I feel like I'm not spelling costume right. <laughs> For some reason, this doesn't look like the right spelling. <laughs> Hold on. I'm asking- I'm asking Google. Okay. I think it is. Costume. Yep, that's the right <laughs> spelling. It just looks weird. It does look weird. That's like when- when you're little and you hear words and whatnot, and you- and you- like, you guess about how it's spelled, but when you actually see the spelling for it, you're like, this is not the same word. <laughs> right. <laughs> like, baloney? If you look at the spelling for baloney, that is- that is not what it sounds like. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> We're- where is the G? Where is this letter coming from? Right. <laughs> <laughs> that waved us over. Over. <laughs> I th should this just be like the like the costume director's first time meeting Chef, he's like, hey, Chef, it's, it's so great to see you and work with you. We're gonna get started with this and whatnot. I'm kind of just um, explaining. And then they get into it. Sure, we could do that. Yeah. I'll work. Okay. Uh, One idea we can think of. Yeah. I could work. <laughs> and then when the costume director waved this over to him. We maybe like, hey, Chris, uh, we're just about ready to start, and then he looks over and sees Chef, and then he's like, hey, Chef is whatever. It's <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Looking, oh shit, looking over at Chef. Looking over, yeah. Looking. 
<laughs> yeah, yeah, I didn't spell it with a K, so it was like ooking. <laughs> I just said before looking over at Chef. Yeah, or uh, looping. Yeah. <laughs> Loops over at. Should this be like should this be like an exclamation point like oh you must be chef or should I just be like a period? Um either one would be fine. Well, let me write the next sentence and then we'll we'll determine if it looks out of place. Yeah. Okay. Hold on. Oh you must be chef. Um How the fuck do you spell production? <laughs> um, there we go, I got it. Oh yeah, that's, that's how you spell Re it. I am so good at spelling. Just not that's reading. <laughs> Fair. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, should this be like... Should this be like another sentence or should this be like a combine, like a compound sentence where it's like, I'm the costume design director for the production. I can't wait to be working with you. Um, yeah, it could be like that. Yeah. I can't wait to be working with you. Work with you today. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> Better grammar. <laughs> Dude, we're gonna ace this shit. <laughs> yes, let's go! I'm, is, I'm really liking how this is turning out so th far. This is our magnum open. <laughs> yeah. Do you have anything that you want to, like, write real quick while I, like, I think? <laughs> um... I'm trying to think. Huh. <laughs> uh... <laughs> trying to think of... I'm not sure if I should have, like, uh, Chris or Chef responding to that, or... Maybe Chef, because now, like, he went- yeah. he took the focus from Chris to Chef, and now oh, speaking yeah, directly yeah, right. to him. Okay. Um... To um, it's an honor to meet you. <laughs> you know, I feel like that's that's something that Chef would say. You know, before he gets like all mad at the yeah. world. <laughs> Okay. Okay. <laughs> maybe we should maybe we should end the chapter. Then like like they're right about to start doing yeah. the costume thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And it's like, an honor. I feel like I should add more than just that. Like, oh great, it's an honor to meet you. Um, uh, I feel like this is good, but we can like describe how Chef like like delivers <laughs> the line. Oh, yeah. Like, Chef says very yeah. excitedly. Yeah. Or Chef says with a smile. Like, something. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, great. Oh, okay. Yeah. No, I was looking at our, like, synopsis thing of, like, how we wanted the chapter to go. But Chef, like, did introduce himself and does the interview. He gets hired. Then we just, like, have some moments of the two building a friendship chapter ends with bonding. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so I, I feel like they did some, like, some bonding in the break room and whatnot. Just a natural conversation between the two. And then yeah. we'll just end it right before they start doing costumes. So maybe, like, okay. right before the, the chapter ends, Chris, like, does his thoughts. Of, like, mm -hmm. what he's gonna be expecting and whatnot. Or his last thoughts on Chef before the chapter ends. Yeah. Yeah. 
Ah, that, that's what I would do. <laughs> chefs. Chef. With a smile. With a smile. Perfect. I like that. Wait, I got it. Hold on. <laughs> Wait, oh. I think I actually might be going with it. Yeah. So maybe like, yeah. this will probably be the last paragraph, right? So, mm -hmm. we should have it be like, Chris, but not Chris, I'm sorry. Well, it is Chris's POV, because, I mean, he's the main character of this. Like, um, like, like, then Chris, sorry, Chef and the costume director walk over to the little, like, area that they're, they're making the costumes and they start looking like, Chef seems excited, over, like, while he's looking over some of the, the concepts and whatnot. While Chef, uh -huh. sorry, while Chris is, like, still by, like, the entrance looking at them do this, and admires Chef for being very, like, optimistic and being super happy. Yeah. That, that's, that's the book. Yes. <laughs> Perfect. I like that. I'm loving- I'm loving where this is going so far. I like how I, like, I got up and one <laughs> it just, like, walked around yeah. while I explained. <laughs> yeah. It felt right to do so, you know? <laughs> oh. <laughs> Sometimes you get, like, a big brain idea. You gotta, like, get up and walk, you know? Yeah. True. Yeah. It's like, oh, sh I don't know if you, if, like, anyone else can relate to this. Probably you, Kenzie. But, like, when you're reading fanfiction and an absolute great moment happens that you've been dying to happen in the fanfiction that you're reading happens, you uh -huh. just gotta, like, get up and, like, walk. And you just gotta, like, disperse your <laughs> excited energy in a healthy way. Yes. Yes. On yes. Yes. That is, that is very relatable. Mm-hmm. Yes. And... <laughs> head over to <laughs> Is that the right wear? No, 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 that's not. That's not the right wear. <laughs> <laughs> They're making... <laughs> making... <laughs> Some of the costumes. It almost sounded like you were saying where they are. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm surprised I was able to pass, actually. Yeah. But uh, yeah. I'd say funny story is a little sad. Not, I mean, not really sad, it's just like making fun of my own intelligence and whatnot. <laughs> but like, in eighth grade, we I don't know if anyone remembers the I Ready stuff. It went not- it kind of got introduced, like, late when I was in middle school. Mm -hmm. But it was, like, this little program, mainly for English. But, um, yeah. you get to, like, read passages, and you get tested and whatnot, and you get to read books and get quizzed on them and whatnot. It was, like, a, like a, it was a pretty good way of educating kids. And also, yeah. at the beginning of the, the semester, like, of grade 8, when they introduced the iReady thing, we all took the same kind of exam through it to see our reading level. Uh, I tested as a third grade reading. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you can you can imagine. I tested like I had the most improvement going from a third grade to like an eighth yeah. grade by the end of the year. <laughs> I may or may not relate to that because <laughs> my reading skills aren't exactly the best either. Well, my comprehension skills aren't really the best. Yeah. Yeah, those, like, I don't know if anyone else can relate to it, it's the, like, the exams and whatnot, when they give you, like, this long-ass story and they want you to answer five questions with right? it. Like, I can do yeah. the who, what, when, where, wait, no, fuck. The who, what, when, where, why, and the how and whatnot. Yeah. But, like, when you ask me, like, in-depth about shit, I'm like, I don't fucking know. <laughs> yeah, me neither! Like, those questions are hard! That's like the, like, the, the English teachers that are like, why do you think the author decided to describe that the door is red. I don't right. know. Maybe he I just likes know. the color red. I don't know. Yeah. Stop asking like, me. I'm, I'm in school. You should know this. Lady. Yeah. 
Too, too many expectations. <laughs> Jeff was uh, flipping uh, through. Through? Yeah, through. <laughs> Concept art with the director. While. Wait, it should be like. A, there we go. I'm learning proper English <laughs> while I. Yeah. Stood by the entrance. Admiring. Ad, ad? Yeah, admiring. <laughs> Shit. Admiring from afar. Uh, Chef seems. to be doing us such a small task mm -hmm. small task like <laughs> I think I'm fine. alright hold on Jeff and the costume director head over to the table where they're making some of the costumes. Jeff was slipping through some of the concept art with the director while I stood by the entrance, admiring from afar. Jeff seems so happy to be doing such a small task, like, or maybe just like that. Yeah. While I... What's it? I, I don't want to use cuss words in this and whatnot for writing purposes because yeah. it, it sounds cleaner. Uh -huh. Not, but like how? Because like my initial thing was to write. Chef seems so happy to be doing such a small task like that. Wow, I couldn't give a fuck. <laughs> but like, how do I say right. that in a nice way? <laughs> maybe. Uh, maybe that couldn't care like less. That's the nicer. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I had to think back to that stupid TikTok thing where it was like this lady kind of like it's like translating being mean to a professional way in like an email or like in an office setting and whatnot. Uh huh. Oh, I gotta find one. They're really funny because like she'll just like go off of what she like wants to say, but then this other yeah. dude will kind of translate it into like a business professional way that isn't too mean. Uh huh. I should be like. <laughs> Like, she'll want to type, like, it back in an email, like, Did you not read the fucking email I just sent you, you stupid idiot? And then, the, like, the other person be like, I would like it if you refer to my last email explaining the situation. Right. It's in a nicer way. I'm like, damn, I couldn't do that. <laughs> right. I feel like we, we need to end this on a positive note. Like, what what yeah. is the last thing that Chef thinks before? before the chapter ends. Hmm. I'm so happy. I don't like There surely is something about him. Yes. Y yes, that's perfect. Surely is something about him. That... Get that little chemistry. That impresses me. Yes. Boom. Is that even how you spell it? Impresses? <laughs> I don't- Hold on. I'm asking Google. <laughs> impresses Impresses. Me. Google. I think you have to rem Google. Yeah. Okay. Impresses. <laughs> yeah, that, that's how you spell it. It just, it oh, just okay. looks weird. I don't know why. <laughs> yeah, it does look weird. <laughs> end of end the chapter. This is this is our this is our magnum opus right now. Uh huh. This is gonna stay on the same wave of like like ratatouille, you know? Yeah. <laughs> uh huh. What other like what other books have we read that have been like super good? Like unironically. Uh -huh. <laughs> 
I'm trying, like, all the examples that I'm thinking of are all the bad books that we hate. Yeah. That we're like, I hope this never updates. <laughs> I know what you're talking about. What, the DJ one? Because <laughs> that's the oh, one I thought at first. I'm like, I was thinking of a good book, you know? <laughs> Not that. Remind me, because I can't. Because I always, like, laugh my ass off thinking about that time we were. <laughs> I, we gotta find more books that are as broken of English as that one. <laughs> right. usually, usually, I can excuse that stuff when it's like, um, when it's not like an English speaker re like writing it, like it's a second language translator and whatnot. Because at least yeah. when they're writing it in their native language, is proper, and it just like yeah. Google Translate sucks, you know. So like, I yeah. can excuse that, but like, if you're like an English speaker and your writing's that bad, I think you need to go right. see some help. <laughs> Yeah, I agree. Grammarly's a free resource. <laughs> uh, yep, it is. I'm trying to think of some of the other ones that we don't. Uh, I'm, oh, the, well, that's not a good book. <laughs> I was thinking about that Ella Tyler thing that we just did recently. Oh gosh. Why can't we, we think of a good way book? Too many bad ones, weird ones. Yeah. <laughs> Why can't we not think of a good? There's got to be a good book that we we've we've, uh, we've read. Well, the. The lightning egg sprick one was yes. actually good. That's that one a was good, good one. Yeah. Okay, we one new book we can <laughs> mm -hmm. compare. The, yeah, th this is gonna be on the same level as that book. It's yeah. like it's like neck and neck. Yes. Absolutely. All right. I guess I guess we'll re like I guess reread this on another date and whatnot. But I guess chapter two will be out soon. Mm -hmm. It's going out at a snail's pace, but we're, we're gonna do it. <laughs> yes, we are. We promise. Yes, I, I, yeah, I guess we, we did do it. We got some bonding in there. We did the audition and, and got accepted. This this is the best book that we've ever done. Yes. I am so happy. <laughs> Alright, I'm I'm very I'm very excited to see how we do this, you know? We can go in so many directions with this shit. Yeah. Right. I, well, I hope you had fun, man. This is I I love getting back into writing. This is like a little like writing exercise too, thing. honestly. Yeah, but thank thank you for joining again, dude. I'm, I'm glad welcome. we got to add this to the wheel in the first place. Yeah, I had fun. Yeah. Also, if you guys would like to check out Kenzie's channel, I will have it linked down below in the description and whatnot. Just just click their little at swirly thing in the description and lead you right to their page. Yep. <laughs> Yeah. You need up you need like upload more content, dude. Yeah. I can't keep I know. promoting and then we're like <laughs> I do have a bit of an idea of a of a video that I'm going to make. Mm -hmm. Is it about is it about the new season of this venture camp? Probably <laughs> maybe. <laughs> it may or may not be like a ranking video of the characters inside. Dude, let's go. I'm down for like doing yeah. like a tier list kind of thing. Um, or are you just gonna go individually and like talk about their likes and dislikes yeah. and flaws? I'm just gonna go individually. Yeah, I'm probably just gonna do something like that. Well, dude, let me know if you need help with that. I would love to like, like share my little opinions on them. <laughs> yeah, sure, no problem. Yeah. Also, I, I, I don't know why I almost forgot the most important thing <laughs> about these, uh, these things, and that's spinning the wheel to figure out how oh, screwed yeah. we are. <laughs> Yep. Yeah. Let's go. Yep. Yeah. So I bright. made I made the wheel all different colors and whatnot because I I realized that everyone's wheel and whatnot is like the same color, so I did it a little differently. <laughs> nice. It right. looks better. Yeah, I was like, what screams Kenzie? I was thinking the pastel and whatnot it was like yeah. your vibe. Yes. Right. So as long as it's not. The the chef and Chris thing will will do it and whatnot. Also, I added this. Someone recommended it. It's an Alec finally gets a divorce fan fiction. Oh yeah, I see that one. That one's really good. Yeah. So, <laughs> whoever recommended that, I like skim through. I'm like, this looks like. Yeah. <laughs> I've read it. It's actually real good. I think you'll really like it. All right. Let's hope so. I do like Alec. He, he is a hot British man. Yeah. <laughs> Oh? Oh, wait! Oh! Oh! Well, I guess we're gonna continue at Scott X Bond. Scott X Bond! Aren't you excited? Whoop-de-doo! I yeah. sure am.
Well, you, you're lucky, because I think that'll be the last thing that we'll be reading of, of those two, because I think by the time we, um, we finish that book, it should be done entirely. Yeah. Well, uh, at least you only have to stand the, uh, the Scott X, uh, Dawn thing <laughs> only one more time, and then we never <laughs> talk about it again. <laughs> yes! <laughs> one more time and we're free. <laughs> One more time. <laughs> I mean, there could be worse things that we could read. Like, I mean, Ala Tyler. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yes, yeah. <laughs> no, it's really funny for some reason. Apparently, like, um... There's a lot of, like, characters that are shipped with Alejandro, and they're, they're popping up like crazy on my For You <laughs> thing. Yeah, like, or wait, what about... Remember that one Alan Duncan one we read? Oh, or... there were like both of them. Oh my! Yeah, because there's like the Alan Duncan. <laughs> there's Alan Tyler. There's Alan Noah. That keeps getting recommended. To what? The Alejandro X Noah. God. Oh yeah, and then Alejandro X Heather. I mean, that one's a given because they're they're like oh well, yeah canon. But like a lot of males are shipped with Elahunch. God, this fandom scares me. Yeah, it does. <laughs> I'm surprised we have not found a fan fiction of any of the new cast members yet. Really? Yeah. Like besides the ones that you that you have written, I have not found one yeah. of the other people. Yeah. Maybe if we do find one, we can add it to the list. Cause. Okay. <laughs> Alrighty, well, thanks for joining another Wattpad video. Uh, we have a playlist full of other wonderful things. We have a lot of Wattpad stuff now. It's like 80, 80 videos at this point. Yeah. Uh, it makes me feel like an addict of, like, reading fan <laughs> Also, check out the last video that we, me and Kenzie did and whatnot. Uh, what was it actually? Was it the Ella Tyler thing they were making fun of? I or think no? it was. Damn. Well, yeah. go check that out. I'll have it on screen in a moment. But uh, but thank thank you all. <laughs> but uh, my name is my name is Phoenix. That was Kenzie, and we'll see you guys next time. Take care. Uh, bye. -bye. bye.